Hey guys, welcome to the show. This is gonna be so exciting. I'm so excited to have you all here for the first episode of Better Fifth Homes and Gardens. And we've got an absolute banger of a show for you today. This is gonna be fantastic. We've got a super loaded show for you today with a lot, a lot of tips for you. All right. <laughs> exciting welcome back I've got another cool tip for you have you uh, misplaced all your receipts and all your bills for tax reasons well I've got a little solution for you all you need is a pin board which you can easily get anywhere council put out I got my one for free a pair of scissors and guys I know you drink Pepsi so you should have two empty Pepsi bottles man this is so exciting this is fantastic First of all, just remove the Pepsi labels because we don't want any copyrights. <laughs> Simple as this. Just cut out your Pepsi bottle around the end like that. It doesn't have to be perfect. And I gotta tell you, wow, this is exciting. All you gotta do, grab a couple of pins, stick it right, right there. Wow, that was easy, man. Wow, simple as that. Look at that. And this one you can just write tax for your receipts and this one can be bills. This is exciting. So we got tax and we got bills. Oh look, I've got some tax receipts that I just ripped it. Oh, straight into there, wicked. Oh, I got a bill I know I gotta pay. Oh, slip it right in there and I know there's a bill ready to be paid. That right there is an awesome, awesome organizer, guys. I'm so excited to share this with you guys. Wow. Most building sites have leftover pallets, leftover wood, leftover junk. Go grab yourself five pallets. Now we're gonna go home and I'm gonna tell you exactly what we're gonna make. Once you get home, just rip apart those pallets. Just drill them together and you've got yourself a storage box for your dev pile. You don't need to sand it down. You don't need to do all that freaking fancy shit. But hey, happy days, you got yourself a box. But if you do want to go to the extreme and sand it down and varnish it for your storage box, for your death pile, you can go to the extreme, you can sand it down, you can varnish it, and you can make it all nice like this one. And then you've got another storage box. We've got some horror masks in there. But you've got another storage box for your death pile. Easy as that, happy fucking days. Wow guys, I have got the most amazing little tip for you. Now, if you want to keep the dust and bugs out of all of your shoes that you're selling, well then all you got to do is grab a box of these stockings, and these stockings you should get about 120 of them, and then all you got to do is pay $5 and then you just put on the, the stockings of the shoes and no spiders or bugs or anything is gonna get inside it. Wow, guys, that is so amazing. Yard collections can be great, especially when Council Put Out put out all their junk and you can collect whatever you want for free. Let me tell you what you can grab. So now you've got it home, just slap it on the wall, it doesn't cost much, and if you can't put it on the wall, just put it on a bench or on the floor. Chuck all your game consoles on there, chuck all your DVD players, and Bob's your fucking uncle, you've got a free TV for all your testing of your games. That was super exciting. I'm so glad to see that you all watched the whole show. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe because we'll be back in a couple of weeks time for episode two. <laughs> All right, this is exciting. Mom, stop watching me while I film my stuff, man. It's